One of the things we are studying down here that isn't El Nino related, but carbon dioxide related is studying carbonate chemistry. And we've been taking some water samples near corals to send back to be analyzed to find out what the aragonite saturation is, which is used to understand the levels of carbonates in the water. And those carbonates are needed for animals that build their skeletons out of seawater, including elements like carbonate. And carbonates are getting harder to come by as we increase carbon dioxide. I'm pretty certain that's a thorny head, not positive. That is really that's cool. That's a, that's a nice desktop get, background shot. We have some shots of those, right? Okay, thank you. All right, Aaron, go. It's kind of hard to tell with him wrapped up and not swimming. Oh, ouch. <laughs> right in the <laughs> face. See, rolling all in it. It's like looking at a storm from space. <laughs> Well, it's a type of glass sponge, but other than that, I don't, I've never seen one that's looked like this before. It's really beautiful. Oh, oh. <laughs> it's pretty good. There's usually a shrimp in there, not a, a whole <laughs> rockfish. Yeah, just huh. hang it out. It's be great still. So can we have the lasers off for some yeah. nice shots? Thank yeah. you. <laughs> cool. what, a, what a place to hang out. Yeah. Steve, what is that? That's an oh, octopus. A octopus. Is it? Yeah, it's a flat, flat, uh, flapjack. Flapjack octopus. Flapjack octopus. Yeah, and he's very flat. <laughs> Looking very pancakey. Oh, hi, guy. Up in the eyes there. Beautiful. Yeah. Yeah, it's just so pretty. So I found a fun fact about giant Pacific octopus. It's probably the world's largest octopus. The one individual specimen was recorded weighing 157 pounds. Wow. Holy. Wow. And claims have been made of up to 600 pounds. Wow. wow. The arm span of the octopus is between 14 and 30 feet. Whoa. So that would wow. be of the larger. Been for What's that? Oh, is that a oh. spot prawn under there? That is big. Oh, there's so many. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they are large. If it has a spot prawn. So wow, look at that. They look delicious. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I guess I'm going to sit down here. Yeah, they're, they're one of the larger of the shrimps. Wow. Mm -hmm. Doing a little dance around yeah. too. Yeah. Oh, oh beautiful. Look at that. That's a, looks like a long, long nose skate, I think. And look like it was a male because that's the claspers at the tail. Oh, they're hanging out. <laughs> it's so friendly. Don't trust that hagfish. It's mm. going to do something. <laughs> It's a striped tail. Don't eat it, hagfish. It's still alive. <laughs> Dude, personal space. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like a young one. Juvenile? Someone's a little camera happy. <laughs> Got oh. <laughs> <laughs> get out got the set way! Set <laughs> oh, can you if, um, right. zoom out? Yeah. Oh man! Oh okay, my goodness! That's the camera happy fish right there. <laughs> <laughs> I, I thought, was really I hoping for a predation event. And away uh. he goes. Wow. wow, so we have this Pycnopodia catching krell, actively catching krell. <laughs> you can see the tentacles going mm -hmm. up. How cool. Yeah, and then they'll just slowly pass it down to the mouth. 
I don't think I've ever seen this before. Mm -hmm. I have not. All right, Aaron, zoom in. I think the octopus is going deeper in, not mm -hmm. coming out. Box crab was confirmed by Tom. Box crab. All right, Aaron, let's come full wide. Okay. Oh, the fish must have been swimming around. Yeah, the fish are. I think they're, are they hunting for crow? It's a lot of them. The crab is just perfectly framed in the cloud. <laughs> Too many rockfish. Never too many rockfish. <laughs> wow. I'm going to spin Argus around. Can't see anything anyway. Yeah. So our recovery heading is going to be essentially this one, eh? 160, yep. Go.